Hello and welcome to a new trip to the sea. Uh, today I'm at a place called uh, Røra Skjæra in uh, the fjord Eidanger, Eidangerfjord in uh, south of Norway, in Greenland. The locals know this place very well. Uh, it's a nice fishing spot. You can see the uh, water around here is uh, pretty shallow. They have some reefs there and also a reef to, to my right. I'm gonna fish afterwards. So uh, it's a nice day, uh, a bit early, but uh, the clock is about uh, 10, uh, 38 a.m. Uh, and um, I'm gonna try and uh, fish with uh, two flies on my uh, leader. This is my end fly and this is my dropper. It's a little uh, orange uh, thing called Klimpen. Uh, my setup is today is scientific ambler, angler camel, uh, full in intermediate, and uh, I'm ready to go. So I start fishing out here. I go out on this uh, small rock there and I fish out there in a fan uh, shape, and I'm gonna move towards to, the, to my right. Okay. Wish me luck. <laughs> oh yeah 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 you see that well where is my net when I need it oh my sea trout okay have to show the show you the small one he's going out it's about a half a kilo I think yeah! <laughs> Just had to release it carefully. Can wait, I have weight. Ah, 400 grams, I think. Just about. Was taken on the orange. Flat. There it goes. Ah, 
<laughs> ah, that was nice. Very nice. Indeed. Just get my neck back on place now. So. Yeah, first one. On my setup. Well, I see more fishes rising. Maybe I can be lucky another time. Just over the rise. First fish I got now, it was too small also. It has to go back. But if I get a good size fish, that's that's fat I'm taking home for dinner. But only that, only when I get a good size fish. Over the I have to be 45 centimeters over that that is legal to take it but uh, it has to be fat and uh, well now there's no tangle thank you but uh, Well, there's been uh, plenty fish up rising today, so I have hopes for four for uh, to get some more. Uh, some weeks ago, it was ice here, so I cannot could not fish, but now the ice is gone and uh, the water is free. I shall try. Oh yeah, it's a small one. Well, but fun. It's fun. Oh, a little bit, <laughs> little small sea trout. But it's gonna get that freedom back. I'm gonna show you. you see. Far too small, but they took on the the shrimp. I'm gonna show the shrimp afterwards. I'm gonna put this fish back first. Uh, careful with my rod. Wet my hands and get a grab of the fish. Try not to harm it. On the tip of the mouth, just about. 200 grams, I think. Not so very big, but it was a take. Okay, I tried to get the <laughs> my hooks free from the line, from the net. Sorry. There. Just put my net there. Okay. have to uh, there is a fly made it myself I made make all my flies uh, I tie all my own flies also sell some uh, but here it is little shrimp catch the fish 
Well, I have to get my net back on the back on the magnet. So it's always good to have the net with me. Just put it back on my. Okay, then we try again. The fly has proved its efficiency. So let's do it. Let's do it. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's not so good, good cast, but it'll do for now. Maybe that's the. Maybe I shall, shall let the line sink a little. Maybe. Maybe not. But they like the orange color. To move me a little, just move you as well, so we can see what I'm doing. Like that, a fish out here. You see all the bubbles and uh, the foam. I think that's a good idea. Fish with the wind. No harm for me, I think. All this current and wind takes with me, takes, <laughs> takes with it a lot of uh, food. And uh, I think the fish is on the end there. But you, you never know what the sea trout. There can be everywhere. Oh, to wade out a little. So I can get further out. Now I've changed place. I waded out. I'm on a shallow reef uh, on the upside of this uh, place I was some time ago, <laughs> some uh, minutes ago. So I'm gonna fish out on these shallows here in the bay and uh, over there and afterwards I'll try to go out to this uh, red house there uh, boat garage and uh, fish along this uh, pier there and on the other side well now we start here and we move on if we didn't catch any okay wait out a little so we came past this gravel. Just have to strip out some line from my reel to get it started. Start with some short casts. I don't have to cast so long here. 
will only make trouble for me. Just cast in the fan shape type of fashion. There's very nice bottom truck structure here, so uh, some uh, leopard uh, bottom, they call it. There's also a lot of sand, so there are places for shrimps to eat and thrive. And some places with gravel on seaweed. Well, it didn't, didn't produce any here, so I move a little closer to the shore and try to fish out. You see this pine tree there, just about that. I'm gonna fish there. I just have to cross this small reef here without falling on my face. Oh deeper than I thought but it, it well, went okay. I'm waiting with you guys. Down to the shore and cast out a little here and move to this boat garage. Red boat garage you can see in the front there. Okay, I'll stop here. Try to fish here a little. Out here. Can you see out here so? It's starting to get deeper here so there's a little edge here so I think the fish is if the fish are here, they are on this edge. I don't have so much line out now. You don't I don't have to. It's a bit colder now. The wind is blowing just towards me. And the clock is ticking. 12.30 pm. So Gonna fish uh, about an hour or so more. 
and then it's over for today but I'm pretty happy I got two fish on camera and a good experience together with you guys so maybe it's getting better on the evening here so have to try to come back later in the day sometime some hours but I got fish on my new fly Uganza shrimp I got some fish on uh, similar uh, similar flies before but not this actual fly well it's not so many people out because of the cold and corona and all this other thing that keeps people inside doors but uh, here I'm quite alone and happy having a good time I don't need anything else just right now so Well, nothing and nothing yet. Then we have to move and see if there is something there over the boat garage. I know that people has fished there before and got some. So why don't I try? as well there's nothing here that's for sure well we have to get get on the move again go further down and fish a little outside this little beach here very nice place people who own this place is very lucky it's not Bahamas but it's very nice area in the summer small cabin here is very very full of mud so okay something happened with my feet on the camera one of those is loose but I fixed it okay going out here and try some more
that little session of mine last session didn't pay off so I think I'm heading home and uh, prepare my next fishing trip I have to uh, tie up some flies and have a little family time so uh, I thank you all for uh, watching uh, this video and uh, being with me on this trip uh, if I sum up this trip I am pretty happy though I didn't get any big fish but I get two sea trout on my flies it was a nice uh, experience to have so uh, I'm happy if I sum it up so uh, now I just have to uh, say bye to you people and wish you welcome you back to my next video bye